What's up guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm doing a little haul for you. I only have a few things to open here, but um, I always talk so much during my hauls that it might as well be his own video. <laughs> so let's do it. Okay, let's start with Revolve. I ordered a few things from Revolve for Cabo, which I'm very excited for. Let's check it out. All right, first up we have this really pretty sundress. It's got buttons going down the front, which are really pretty. They're like not normal buttons, they're like little bulbs sort of i just loved this print i love this color for cabo it's so lightweight and this is from the brand capulet by the way i'm gonna have links to everything down below though so you'll be able to see it all there also in a similar color i got this midi dress so this is the midi dress i picked out here's a little close-up on the print really pretty sort of floral and i love the way this color pops against this blue like I said, it's midi, too short to like really show you. And this is from ASTR, the label. Um, I've never actually gotten anything from them before, so I'm very excited to um, check out what it's all about. And then the last I got from Revolve was from Super Down, which is one of my favorite brands that they carry. And it is just this cute, yellow romper how freaking gorgeous is this ties up in the front which is one of my favorite styles you guys know i own like a million things that tie in the front like this i just thought it was the prettiest color and rompers are always so easy to throw on especially on vacation when you're just trying to like put on something cute and go next up i have a package from shein one of my favorite brands as you guys know they spoiled me this time i'm very excited we have so much stuff here i don't even remember what i ordered okay so first up we have this jumpsuit it is a black and white polka dot jumpsuit it sort of like comes in right in the middle here sort of like a little stretchy waist and then it also has like sort of tight around the ankles which i like because then i can make sure that it hits my leg in the place i want to like i can pull it up a little higher and have it stay tight on there it's super casual i really like it next up is just this t-shirt really simple graphic easy to throw on it is so soft so soft it's ridiculous and a little cropped but still long enough that i can tuck it into like some high-waisted shorts or pants or something next up i went for a pair of white pants which i thought would be really fun in cabo and they have this really pretty eyelet detail on it um, which is really popular right now and they're like a little cropped they have a really pretty little like ribbed edge there and i thought these would be so fun with like a bright colored top or even like a little black and white ensemble pair of heels oh yeah then i got one more jumpsuit which is really beautiful and i just thought this would be so pretty for a night out sometime so it has this really pretty lacy detail here obviously you wear a little bralette underneath and then it goes into this just gorgeous black jumpsuit here it looks like it might be a little long on me i'm probably gonna have to hem it but so cute and jumpsuits are just too easy to throw on and look like you really tried even though you didn't <laughs> next up i got this lacy crop top it has a little lace detail along the top i thought this red color was sort of fun something different actually this would look really pretty with these white pants that's really fun simple easy to throw on during the summer next up i got this romper which i'm so excited to wear it's sort of like a beach romper it's the way that i see it going like just something that's really easy to throw over top of a bathing suit it's super lightweight this really pretty fun bright print it has this cool little detail on there just really light easy total cover up next up i got a pair of sandals just another really simple there's sort of strappy so i don't know if simple is the right word actually but um easy to throw on pair of sandals for the summer oh yeah i forgot about this i got this really pretty polka dot romper i thought it was something sort of different like the nude with the black polka dots um and it has a little tie that goes around your neck as well as ties for your shoulder here and a nice open back which is really pretty and then i think the rest of the stuff i got is swimsuits first up this one i just love this cut of swimsuit where it just goes straight across i think it's really flattering and it comes with little matching high-waisted bottoms here looking good next up we're trying this trend out i don't know how it's gonna look on me but this weird shaped bathing suit top trend where it sort of has this weird thing. I don't know, but I was like, you know what? We're gonna try it and I'm obsessed with this color. It's so pretty. They have really pretty cheeky bottoms in the same fun, bright color. I sort of think that I'm gonna end up liking it, but we'll see because this is, it's a weird thing. <laughs> and lastly, I got 
this swimsuit. It has a bandeau top and it is yellow in the front and white in the back. And then same thing with the bottoms. Nice little high-waisted, except the front has like the little white detail, which I think pulls it together all white on the back. Just another fun high-waisted suit. Popping in, sorry for this angle change, but when I was just cleaning up the giant mess from this haul, I found something that I missed from Shein, so I wanted to show you. It is this really cute white bathing suit. I love my white swimsuits. This is the same like cut that I was saying that I really like, and then just little bottoms. There you have it. Yeah, so a bunch of this stuff is coming to Cabo with me, which I'm really excited about. Probably not all of it, because I'm not there for that long, but um, all gorgeous. I'm gonna have links to everything down below so you can find it. Makeup brands always over package their, um, their boxes. Like just put too much tape, too many obstacles. It makes it so much harder to get into. But I am so excited about this package. Oh my gosh, there's so much stuff in here. I'm totally destroying this box because it's hard to get into and I don't care. Whoa. <laughs> Great, let's check it out. <laughs> so this is from Jill Stewart Beauty and um, I thought I'd be the perfect hashtag Jill girl, which is like their whole thing because Jill. Jill Stewart Loose Blush, interesting. First of all, this packaging is gorgeous. Like, let me see if I can get this to focus on it. Do you see all of that detail in there? So pretty, beautiful pink packaging. Gorgeous Light Pink, which is sort of their brand. Oh my God, speaking of beautiful packaging, are you kidding me? This is like gorgeous, what the heck? Okay, but what are you used for? Oh, I see, you use this to apply the blush. Oh my God, ooh, it's so soft. Should we try opening it? I'm like afraid with loose powders, I'm always afraid that they're gonna like run everywhere. Whoa, okay, this is crazy looking. I didn't have to worry about it going everywhere, that's for sure. Can I show you the inside of this? See how it's just like, it has a tiny little mesh area there that gives you access to the product and the rest is covered. And then you just take this and you roll it around in there and apply, oh my gosh. Okay, next up is their Lip Blossom Velvet. Again, packaging is everything on this, wow. Gorgeous little monogram J on there. Do a little swatch. Wow, so pigmented, I barely touched it to my hand. And look at that color. Let's see, this is um, a lip blossom, so not a velvet one, but okay, it looks like potentially the same color, but not velvet. Oh yeah, look at this. So this one is a little bit more sheer and glossy. Lip blossom shiny satin. Oh wait, I just did this on accident, but the little top of this opens. It's sort of like a little mini mirror in there. It totally is a mini mirror. It's not sort of like that, it is. So if you don't have a mirror to apply your lipstick with, that is brilliant. Okay, so again, a similar color, similar finish to um, the normal um, lip blossom. I guess, no, they're both equally shiny, so it's just a little bit of a different color. And this is another lip blossom, who definitely the most sheer of all, which is really pretty feels really nice on my lips. It's like a pretty corally. Nice. And it doesn't feel like sticky at all on my lips. It just feels moisturized, which is nice. Okay, and then these are the things that I was most excited for to get from Jill Stewart. These are their jelly eye colors, and I'm sort of dead over these. Okay, so these are just really pretty mousses, basically. Well, I mean, it's like very jelly. Let's see, like very. Love it though. And it's super pretty shiny, let me, and just really sheer. It doesn't feel sticky at all. I don't even know if you guys can see that. Really nice, sheer, beautiful. This one is Diamond Snow, which is a more white color rather than nude. Oh my God, it's so weird watching it jiggle, honestly. Weird in a good way though, like it looks very cool. Okay, yes, whoa. Look at that right there, wow. And then this one is in Rose Romantic, which I think is a more pinky one. Oh yeah, and that one's like all the way to the end over there. Yeah, you can see it when the light hits it. So pretty, oh my gosh, I can't wait to play with these on my eyes. You guys, I'm the worst, I found another thing that I missed. This is a Blend Blush Blossom. Ooh. Pretty, just some pretty pink blushes and what is this oh oh I um a little blush brush 
has a little like thing. You can pull it up to just this top one if you want it to be a little bit more condensed, or you can push it over and bring it up higher and make it a bigger, fluffier brush. Brilliant. I dig their stuff, guys. It's very cool. And then I guess really quickly, I'll show you this little crop top that I just picked up from Urban. If you guys saw my last vlog, you probably already saw this, but I'll show you anyway. My camera shut off on me, rude. Anyway, it's sort of like this funky printed crop top. It has like, if you can't tell, it has a big hole in the middle there. So it sort of like shows a little bit here. And then the straps are tie straps which I love the look of when you have like little bows on your shoulders, it's so pretty. And there you have it. That is everything that I had to haul for you guys today. So I hope that you enjoyed it. I hope it wasn't too long, too boring, too whatever. And I will catch you guys in my next video. Bye guys. Bye.